On Wednesday morning at about 7.15, Ivanka Trump issued mm. a tweet in which she called the chemical weapons attack horrific and atrocious and heartbreaking. And she is not a person who tweets casually. Um, she's, very, she's very measured in her communications. This was the first time I had seen her take such a, uh, such a, a strong position about an international you know, security military issue. Yeah. And um, I was struck by it. Um, she had seen the photos. Clearly, they had made a very deep impression on her. I would not be the least bit surprised if she and or Jared Kushner, the, her husband and the president's really close advisor, showed them to him and shared with him their outrage. And he basically felt the same way. Um, you know, Trump is all about, and the way Trump governs is all about proximity. So mm -hmm. if you can get close to him physically, then you can really have his literal ear. And he often makes quick decisions based on the last piece of information he's heard. Hmm. We should be really clear here because Breitbart, their comment section right now is a disaster because they're furious. I can imagine. That he has bombed Syria. Uh, his alt-right supporters, uh, Mike Cernovich and these guys, the, the, the Donald on, on Reddit, right, all these people that, that are Donald supporters, they're all livid that he is taking action in another country, military action in another country. This goes directly against what he has always said, as you point out. Like, this is red meat to his people is we can't be the world's cop anymore. Right. right. And that's kind of... And it goes been guiding it, his that, that guided his foreign policy on the campaign trail. Right, and it, this directly, uh, you know, this directly contradicts the sort of <laughs> Bannon doctrine. Yeah, yes, of, totally yeah. of foreign policy, which exactly is let them let the world duke it out, um, you know, close the borders, stay home, look after your own, and um, a, and yet Bannon's power within the White House has been waning to some yeah. degree. 